February is Black History Month, and tonight we honor the contributions of businesswoman Vanessa Whiting. She's the owner of 16 restaurants in Northeast Ohio. Her mission, not just serving great food, but providing opportunities and second chances to those who work for her. Leon Bibb reports. A story of fried chicken served spicy and succulent. This chicken, hot out the pot, is also a building block for communities and life in them. This is the business end of a Popeye's Louisiana kitchen restaurant. I have no this Popeye's is in East Cleveland, where when the door is open, customers follow their noses, picking up something delicious in the air. Oh, I have made some sandwiches now. They'll tell you, I can make a, I can make a, 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 a filet uh, sandwich. Vanessa Whiting owns 16 Popeye's in Northeast Ohio. She is one of the largest black owners of Popeye's franchises in the country. She studied spiced chicken, and it took her to success. For 30 years, she practiced law, sometimes handling legal work for a friend who owned a Popeye's Popeye's franchise. Friends said, maybe you ought to get into the chicken business. In the 1990s, Vanessa and husband Anthony Tony Smith dived in. We got educated and we prepared ourselves for success. But this, others can do this. And that's what I would say to young people. Husband Tony ran the operation, adding more stores. Vanessa busied herself with the couple's legal work. But in 2014, at age 52, Tony died leaving Vanessa with the decision of whether to stay or go. She set aside the law practice and went full steam into running of what has become 16 restaurants. Oh, this is full time. <laughs> I mean, this is more than 40 hours a week yeah. for you, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, oh certainly it is. And, uh, but my people work just as hard as I do. In fast food restaurants, the accent is on fast. In the back, employees bustle with the chicken breasts and whirl onto the chicken wings, all the while keeping the biscuits hot. Vanessa says it's the company way. So too is customer relations. I walk in, I'm getting greeted, I'm getting suggested. <laughs> of selling, I almost, I almost wept. <laughs> a story about restaurants and chicken and beans and rice, of course, but really more than that, also a story about jobs for a community, especially those who are coming out of prison looking for second chances in life. Vanessa Whiting has found a recipe to strengthen both lives and the community. You can change people's lives, not just your own lives, just not just your family, but other families. 16 locations provide jobs, 400 employees so far, restaurants in neighborhoods which can always use another thriving business. As for further expansions, you get the idea Vanessa Whiting is not chicken about taking well-calculated chances. But then again, if you catch my drift, she is chicken. <laughs> in more ways than one. For 3 News, I'm Leon Bibb.